Three handgun arrests in a single night, all caught on camera in Fells Point. It comes as Fox 45 continues to hear from business leaders who say the city's safety plan isn't enough of a deterrent. Jeff Abel joins us live now with a closer look at the new videos. Jeff? Well, in a matter of three hours this weekend, officers had pulled three different guns from the streets of Fells Point, one of them from a 16-year-old child. And our cameras were there for the takedown. It was a few minutes before curfew when at Fleet and South Broadway Friday night, officers noticed a teenager packing a gun under his belt. When he was stopped and searched, officers found not only a gun, but nine live rounds of ammunition. The suspect was 16 years old. Three hours later and one block away, officers came running after two more suspects. This was the scene on South Broadway where officers had noticed a handgun sticking out from under the driver's seat of a vehicle. A search turned up two loaded guns and the arrest of 28-year-old Cameron Booker and 25-year-old Isaiah Little. And my employee was walking up to her car and got in the middle of gunshot. Business owners in Fells Point have long complained about late night street parties where the crowd is often armed with illegal guns and alcohol. And these are not just uh, young people from, you know, two different high schools who don't get along. These are serious criminal enterprises. The city has now assigned an army of officers to help keep the peace on summer weekends. But as weapons continue to surface, one business owner is calling for a new strategy. All this is just in case something goes wrong. But the one thing we're not doing is preventing something from going wrong before it happens. So the actual problem still exists because there's no real engagement. The two adults arrested here this past weekend are being held without bond. The 16-year-old is now in the hands of Maryland's juvenile services. The square used to be a spot where people would go out at night, at night sit out on the benches and enjoy it. You can't do that anymore. Well, police not only found a gun on that 28-year-old suspect, but they say they also found drugs, and they believe he had intended to distribute them. We are live tonight, Jeff Abel, Fox 45 News. I'm Kai Jackson. Thank you for watching. Here's another video to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.